Hi traders, this is Forex Nelson and I'm back again today with another A Trades. Today's date is January the 10th and I'm using my new Pip Sniper trading system. This one uses momentum which gives an audio sound and a pop-up box. Here's the pop-up box. There it is right there, momentum either crossing up or down. And of course the other one, sell and buy alerts, are the arrows for the super signal indicator, which I added on about three months after I did the videos. So this was an add-on after the fact. Now this super signal uh, indicator it really helps a lot to find the beginning of the up and down cycles within the market. It's great for traders who love to scalp the markets on the five minute time frame. In other words, you can easily trade all three trading sessions 24 hours a day. Remember, you really need four things to succeed at trading. You need a lot of chart time. You need a lot of demo trading. Remember, demo trade before you go live. You need a lot of education, and I can provide a lot of education. And of course, you need a daily trade plan. Now, you should be uh, continuing your education every two or three months if you want to succeed at trading. So every morning at 6 o'clock, I'm in front of the computer, right where this vertical line is. I'm looking at all the instruments, and I'm taking a look at the daily trade plan. Now this is the daily trade plan. It's an expert advisor that runs in real time. It's um, so my old one, I used to take about 30 minutes to put it together. And this will change as the time moves on. And it is um, preset like if you're a day trader. So you want to get in, manage the trade and close the trade. But you can change the inputs like if you're a swing trader and or a position trader. It's a great tool to have. And as you can see, the trades that I've taken down here at the bottom, it was um, showing the same thing um, taken directly from my daily trade plan. This is a screenshot from a couple hours um, uh, before. It's around 8.30 in the morning. As I'm doing this video, I closed them all out right almost at a minute, 7.52. And I got in at uh, um, an hour to an hour and a half uh, before that. So an hour to an hour and a half of trading and I'm done trading for the day. So now we can get into these trades. Here we go. First one was the Euro Yen. Bought it. There's the arrow. I, I manually put in the arrow just to remind me not that I really need it as the charts as I look at it I know it's going to go up with 95% certainty in other words um, when I took the trade I was expecting it to go at least to this area resistance which is what happened and uh, you know it could have easily right from here or here gone straight up another 100 pips but that's not what happened today. But I was happy. And basically when I look at the bottom and when I feel like I got 200 or more pips and ticks, I am closed the trades, I'm done for the day. So on this trade, I closed it out being happy with looks like six pips. And those six pips ended up paying $453. Moving on to the next trade, which is the Pound Aussie. Another one I wanted to be buying. Here's the arrow directly from the daily trade plan. Remember, it's very important that you have trade management and money management in order. And the market is very random. It's to be expected to have a pullback. It could bounce here and it could go up, break the top and keep uh, moving. Or it could break the bottom here and go all the way down to here or here or here. So trade management, keep an eye on your trade. Got in here and I was happy at this point with again six pips and those six pips ended up paying out uh, $480. Okay. 
Okay, moving on to the next trade, the Dow Jones. Now this one pays $5 for each um, tick. I dropped it down to the five minutes to get a little bit better reading on it. Everything looked great. It did qualify. Um, I'm, if I'm not mistaken, all of these trades qualified like for a great way to trade. So this is where I saw it. Here's your setup candle. Here's your trigger candle. And this is where I actually saw it. And I pulled the trigger at this cursor and I got out around this cursor looks like with about 32. And by the way, um, if you take the money and divided it by five, calculator says 32, so that's right on. So 32 ticks times the money, lots paid out $1,600. Moving on to the next trade, which is the Euro Aussie. Wanted to be buying it. There's the arrow, qualified for a great way to trade. Everything blue at the bottom. Trading with the Pip Sniper is easy and a lot of fun. At least it is for me. Setup candle, trigger candle, get in. And that's exactly what I did. And I closed it out, uh, as I said, just being happy. Looks like if it doesn't break the top, it's going to go back to the goal line. But I'm done trading for the day. And it's not even 9 o'clock in the morning. Looks like uh, 26 pips. And those 26 pips on this trade paid $1,784. Moving on to the next trade, which is the Euro New Zealand. Wanted to be buying it. There's the arrow. Um... Everything looking good for going up. And I teach everything that you should be looking for, um, how the trade should look prior to pulling the trigger. So I took the trade at this cursor and I close it out again, just being happy. Looks like with uh, 40 or 39, I guess, 39. 39 uh, pips and that ended up paying out $2,540. Moving on to the next trade, which is the Russell. This one pays $10 for each uh, tick. Everything looked good, qualified for a great way to trade. Took, uh, let's see, this is your setup candle, this is your trigger candle, got in. And I close it out right here on this so called hammer. Just being happy uh, uh, with, uh, should be 33, looking at the money since it pays $10 for each uh, tick. So there it is right there, 33, you remove the last digit. And that's why you see it ended up paying out $3,300. Moving right along to the next trade, the S&P 500. Here we go. S&P 500 pays $5.00. For each tick. Moving on to the next trade. This S&P 500 pays five dollars for each tick. I took the money, divided it by five. Calculator says it's uh, 75. So let's see. Pull the trigger here and uh, there it is right there. You remove the last digit. It's 75 ticks and that ended up paying out three thousand seven hundred and fifty dollars. Moving on to the last trade, the NASDAQ. This one is $20 for each uh, tick. So I ended up taking the trade. There is a sell signal back here, but this is where I actually saw it. Went sideways a bit and then it finally dropped. We got another sell signal right here, along with the setup candle, trigger candle. Now the calculator says it should be uh, roughly uh, 38. So it should be 38 ticks. And there it is right there. You remove the last two digits. 38 times the money times the lots paid out $7,580. So another great day of trading using my Pip Sniper. I added up all the pips and the ticks and I knew it was going to be over 200. 
turned out to be 255 pips and ticks and all of those pips and ticks paid out $21,488. So if your system is not producing like my pip sniper well I recommend you get your hands on it and don't forget uh, about the daily trade plan which is a must have. Now I've decided to um, shorten the videos as um, I'm sure some traders were saying 20-25 minutes was just too long doing the best at that so if you want to get some more information and if you're interested in getting anything from me all you got to do is get in contact with me and if you look right below this video you'll see four packages obviously I recommend to get all four but you can buy just one if you want but um, just check out the four packages my ongoing special is if you buy two I'll give you any one of the other two for free. And also my contact information is right below this video in the description. You can call me directly, you can email me, and uh, I do prefer Skype. Keep in mind, um, if we make Skype contact, I'll give you a free session, I'll answer your questions, give you some tips and tricks. Keep in mind I do all of that with no obligation to you. So it's time to wrap up this video. And of course if you like the video, please give it a thumbs up and please subscribe to my YouTube channel. So till the next trading day and video, well I know it'll be this week. Uh, between now and then, I want to wish you good luck uh, with your trading and remember to keep yourself and your family safe. Okay, bye for now.